Okay, good evening. Uh, our topic for today or our tutorial for today is about how to monitor a CPU cores per core in a Sabic server. Okay, monitoring per core. Okay, let's let's go to Sabic server. Click configuration and click host. Okay. As you can see here, I'm using Windows Server for this example. And I'm using three cores, CPU core here, three cores. Okay. Let's go back to Tabix, host, and then let's create an item. As you can see here, I already add the CPU core zero because uh, system core, system CPU core, or CPU core is start from zero. 0, 1, 2, 3, something like that. So I already add the CPU core number core 1. But it started to core 0. Okay. So as you can see in this code, CPU core 0. And then in a key, this is the magic item key system that cpu that you did zero which is the number of core so that is the core one is considered as core zero then this is the abg uh, this is the total values uh, this is the total average value of all values for last one minute you can change to 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. It's up to you. And then here is a numeric float. Type of information numeric float. I use percent in a unit. Okay. So this is the core 1. So now we create a core 2. I name it to 0, 1 because that can, like what I've said before, the core is start to zero. So, so this is a number two core. I just the numeric load hashtag I percent so, and then click add. Then create again core zero two, the third core. Number load percent. Then add again. Again, I only use I only use three core here. So you can see three core. So let's check if it's working. So to check if it's working, we create graph. So I already create the graph of first core. So I create for the second core. Then click add another graph for the third core. Set to click add and then CPU core two. Click add. Okay, to check, you can go to monitoring, host, and click the Windows server here, and then grab. Let's check. So this is the core one. So this is the first I configure in the server. So this is a core two. 
as you can see there's a data here and here you can see the line here and here means it's working we can create uh, another item create let's uh, let's name CPU for uh, CPU for zero three and then CPU this is number three then numeric load percent okay then add then let's grab create grab CPU three and then click add just the number three and add let's check in monitoring host and the graph let's check cpu core is working see if core zero is working which is the core one core two is the cpu core zero one then core three which is this is a cpu cores three so it, it's working also but here cpu core three this is a core four why it's why it's not working because i'm just i'm using a three core only here see it's only three cores Okay, now it's work. So thank you.